What is up, everybody? We are here, and we are playing Injustice 2. This is Commentator Julian, your favorite Commentator Julian out of all Commentator Julians. You know it. And today, it's going to be Julian and Nate from Moon J facing off against each other to see who the better uh, Injustice 2 player is. Okay, so we have Julian on the left and Nate on the right, I believe. We'll find out in just a second as our characters are picked. Okay, so yes, we have Julian on the left who is most likely picking Blue Beetle. This video was recorded a while ago, so I do not remember how it goes down. So we will have a fun time making this video. And Nate picking Gorilla Grodd. And they will be fighting in the Slaughter Swamp. Uh, let us know if you guys like these types of videos. We have a lot of different character combinations we could do, and we could even do some tournaments. So that would be pretty cool to try out, and uh, we'll see how you guys like these, and we'll make more of them. All right, so we got Blue Beetle absolutely going hand on Gorilla Grodd already. Blue Beetle is one of Julian's favorite characters. Yes, I am Julian. Yes, I did refer to myself in the third person. Do I care? Not much, no. And then Gorilla Grodd is probably Nate's favorite DC character besides King Shark. Because King Shark is an absolute legend. Okay. This battle's starting off kind of slow. We got Blue Beetle doing some damage. Gorilla Grodd and Blue Beetle just like jumping around, I guess. So they're jumping. They're doing the hops. It's not basketball, but they are jumping. Um... I believe this is going to be a best of three scenario, so we'll see how these go. Uh, Blue Beetle taking out Gorilla Grodd's first bar of health already. And Gorilla Grodd going full Hulk on him and slamming him like he is just a playful Loki. And now he is using his ultimate power up and just absolutely demolishing Blue Beetle. And that is a scary sight to see. Holy crap. Okay, okay, and he Loki-fies him again. This isn't even Marvel, but Blue Beetle says, no, not today, look at what I can do. Kapow, kapow, boom, chakalaka, bang, scoop de whoop -de poop, this is not a Kanye West song. Okay, so this is a fairly close matchup. Uh, not anymore, never mind, just, just never mind. We got Blue Beetle with his whole red bar still full, and part of his gray one, and then Gorilla Grodd has less than Julian's gray bar. So I think we know he's going to win this. But we do have an alligator who is thrown in misses. It is a missed alligator. It always sucks when you throw an alligator at somebody and you miss. But yeah, we'll see how this one ends with a couple seconds left to go, most likely. And there it is. Gorilla Grodd is KO'd and Blue Beetle takes fight one, which is Julian winning fight number one okay if there's other characters you guys would like us to play with um let us know too we could do a different type of like style for all of these so if you want us to do a tournament with multiple people and introduce new people into our videos let us know let us know if you like bigger tournaments smaller tournaments what you want to see or maybe you want like a league and we could start a league of some sort just let us know anything you guys have ideas for we are completely open to hearing out and trying a few of them and maybe putting our own twists into them all right so we got black lightning on the left which now there he is versus scarecrow on the right now in our past times of playing this we know somebody who absolutely annihilates every single person with Scarecrow. So we'll see if Nate can come out on top and beat Julian's Black Lightning with Nate's Scarecrow. Let's see it. Scarecrow absolutely going ham already. Just freaking hit him with some weird hook that is very scary. They don't call him Scarecrow for no reason. He scares more than crows. Black Lightning trying to throw in some punches. Gets a few down. Black Lightning does have a CW show. Scarecrow does not. So will that help Black Lightning catch the dub? We're fairly even right now. Black Lightning tries to throw an engine of some sort. It doesn't work. But he does zap him like a light switch when you touch it and it zaps you. And, oh, Black Lightning going ham. But he misses some shots in the absolute comebacker from Scarecrow to even it up. Scarecrow's attacks are doing a lot more damage than Black Lightning's. Black Lightning has by far landed the most, but Scarecrow's have done a lot of damage. 
Black Lightning af absolutely playing Scarecrow like a volleyball, and Scarecrow wastes his uh, ability. Wow, okay. So he misses it, doesn't even get to use it on the 150 health that uh, Black Lightning does have. And Black Lightning using his, his, and he is going to town on him. He is throwing him, he is flying, he's going to outer space and the moon, and he's got a fist. He has a fist. We have a Hulk. Well, we have a fist. And, oh, Scarecrow finally leveling out the playing field a little bit more as Black Lightning's now in his red bar and is already close to tied with him. But, no, Black Lightning with a comebacker to combat him and absolutely do nine hits and take some damage off of uh, Scarecrow's health bar. But Scarecrow now come. Oh, oh, I repeat, he's not doing good. Okay. Somehow this is close, and just like that, Scarecrow takes the lead, but now Black Lightning has the lead. This is a close one. Scarecrow uses his ability and hits Black Lightning. There is no way Black Lightning is surviving this, so it's safe to say, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, nope, he's, he's gone. He's gone. Yep, dead. It's safe to say Scarecrow won that one, and uh, that's scary, and really scary. Okay, that's okay. Um, well, now we're on to round three, the final round, after watching that scary crow, man, go ham on Black Lightning. It is tied 1-1, Julian is on the left, Nate is on the right, and I believe we're going to get a, a really epic showdown between Batman and Superman. Now, Julian, myself, does not like Superman at all. I just don't. Okay, he's overpowered and somehow still sucks. I do like Batman, on the other hand. So let's see what's going to happen here. We got Batman versus Superman. It is tied 3-3. Th I mean, 1-1. One, one, best of 3. Coming here. Whoever wins this will be the champion. And we are looking forward to make more videos like this. Hopefully you guys like them. Hopefully you guys have some cool ideas. Hopefully we have some cool ideas coming up. Um, I'm trying to get more into these commentator videos. Just because uh, they're a lot easier to make than real life videos. Especially with uh, starting school. Which we don't like. Nobody likes starting school. So, we're looking forward to making more videos like this. It is fairly tied right now as Batman throws a piece of candy at Superman, I believe. Not sure. He's got like a kryptonite punch going on, too. We're in a really creepy carnival that is falling apart in the background as we fight. So, that's pretty cool. The scenery in these are pretty epic. Batman is going to town on Superman as he does 18 backflips and continues to do them. We have a scary Joker thing and he throws more candy at Superman. Kids, don't eat candy. Not even Superman can survive it. Batman taking the gray out of Superman's health bar. Let's see it. Oh, Batman about to do a solid hit on Superman, but Superman punches him all the way to daytime from the nighttime. That's how hard that punch was. And he catches him and slams him down. Yes, Batman is a human. No, does that matter? No, no. Superman apparently can't kill a human from throwing him at the ground. Now we got Batman tackling Superman and sending him up in the air because Superman apparently cannot fly anymore. He is also at the moon. He is being shot. Superman is immune to everything but kryptonite. And those were not kryptonite. But because it is injustice, he is no longer immune. So let's see if Batman can catch this dub without even losing his gray health bar. It's really low. He's about a hit away from losing it. But Superman is about five hits away from losing the whole thing. And he's one hit away. And he hits Batman and takes away his gray health bar. Will Superman come back? Definitely not. He does make a fight right there. But it will not happen as Batman wins the rightful winner of every fight ever. Because Batman is just the best. We hope you enjoyed this video. Like, subscribe, let us know any more content you like. And what is your favorite superhero? Do you prefer Marvel or DC? Please let us know. Thank you for watching. It's Moo and Jay. Commentator Julian. Peace.